Good evening and welcome. I'm Vincent McCory. This is Africa 54. Now, the United Nations Security Council is condemning an attack Sunday on a hotel in Somalia that killed at least 12 people, including the owner of the hotel and military commander and two lawmakers. Authorities say the militants triggered a car bomb at the entrance of the Shafi Sahafi Hotel in Mogadishu just before gunmen stormed the site. Now, the hotel is popular with government officials and business executives. Among those killed was General Abdi Karim Yusuf Dagabadan, a former army commander who led the offensive that forced Al Shabaab to retreat from Mogadishu in August 2011. Somali Security Minister Abdurazak Omar Mohammed told VOA the attackers were wearing Burundian military uniforms which he says they may have obtained during al-Shabaab's deadly attack on a Burundian military base in June. Al-Shabaab claimed responsibility for the attack in a statement Sunday. Now, the group controlled most of southern Somalia as recently as 2010, but was forced into the countryside by the African Union and Somali government forces. Now, the militants carry out frequent attacks, often targeting government officials and African Union troops.